Hi, I'm Ayo Tunde Baluguen. Here's your Channel's TV Evening News recap for September the 14th, 2019. The Ogun Governorship Election Petition Tribunal has dismissed two suits filed by the candidate of the APM, that's the Allied People's Movement, Mr. Dikuli Akinladi, challenging the victory of Governor Dakwa Abiodun. The tribunal dismissed Mr. Akinladi's suit on false qualification, noting that the petitioner was unable to prove the allegation beyond reasonable doubt and describing it as frivolous, lazy and deficient. To security matters, the Nigerian army has given an assurance that the Boko Haram insurgency in the northeast is over and what is left are criminal elements committing various crimes. The army backed its new position with the fact that the criminals no longer pretend to be championing any cause other than a quest for materialism as manifested in the killing of innocent people. Meanwhile, President Mohamedou Buhari is attending a one-day extraordinary summit of the ECOWAS heads of state and government on counter-terrorism in Burkina Faso. At the end of the summit, the regional leaders are expected to adopt an action plan to address the spread of terrorism and violent extremism in the region. On the international scene, Zimbabwe gave former leader Robert Mugabe a state funeral on Saturday, with African leaders paying tribute to a man lauded as a liberation hero. Mugabe's casket, draped in the green, black, gold and red Zimbabwe flag, was marched slowly into the stadium, accompanied by a military band and an escort of officers. Mr. Mugabe died last week in Singapore at the age of 95. And in sports, Tammy Abraham's superb hat-trick ensured a comfortable victory for Chelsea in a 5-2 thriller against Wolverhampton Wanderers in the English Premier League. Abraham's treble was supported by two other graduates from the Chelsea Academy, centre-back Fikayo Tomori, who opened the scoring with a stunning 30-yard strike. His first for the club and midfielder Mason Mount, scorer of the added time fifth. And that's the evening news recap. And don't forget to join us tomorrow for fresh updates. I'm Ayo Tunde Balugo. Thank you for watching.